Hey guys, so today um, I will be showing you how to get the blueprint that we were using for our plane. Um, over here, this one, this plane. Uh, the reason I uh, didn't do a video on this first was because I thought it's going to be pretty straightforward, but it is a bit, um, it's a bit confusing on how to get this exact blueprint uh, as it is, seeing it's not in a PNG or JPEG format. So, um, the place where I got my blueprint was uh, this website from Boeing um, they have actual drawings of the planes that I think they've made them so you can have a look at them and you know you can use them so the plane file that I've used is this one the 777-300 and first of all what you want to do is just download this so click on here and download it should be in a zip format so just unzip it here you should have a dxf format um don't worry if your icon doesn't say anything this is just an extension that i have another application so you do not need to worry about that at all so go to blender um open a new file actually don't save uh go to edit and preferences then here you should have been the add-ons menu and all you should do is type in auto and you should find these two uh, box these two options now these are checked for me by deep I've checked them for myself so it should be off for you so all you would have to do is just check these two and that's it that's all you have to do so once you've done that just close the preferences tab close blender let's relaunch it real quick new and okay yeah, so in a new file so all you have to do is click file import auto autocad dxf downloads and you should find wherever you have your um file smack that in and yeah there we are um delete the cube uh where is this it's very uh oh where's the file okay it's there so <laughs> it's here, hold on. Uh oh. There. It should be somewhere here. So, by default, for me, it is. Yeah, so this is how your plane should look like. And a fun fact is um, if you hit tab, this is actually drawn in Autodesk Maya or in any of the um, sketch apps that you can sketch up diagrams. So, these are actual vertices. So, you could in theory just you know mess around with them but just leave them the way they are and the reason I prefer these ones over um, PNG files is that you could actually make cockpit windows a million times easier because the front view here all you would have to do is separate this bad boy and just knife project it onto your actual plane which we will be doing pretty soon so yeah, so that's how you would uh, go about importing the DXF file. Um, I hope you, I hope this video was helpful, and I will be uploading the cockpit windows and the tail video in just in just a couple of minutes. So thank you.